I'm doing a test on people, because I work at Lowe's, but I see a lot of people. So I'm doing a test to see if people actually know this. The scratches on my arms, because they're pretty just yeah. stupid. Fire them businesses, because if they're illegal, no green card or whatever, they shouldn't be here. They shouldn't have yeah. jobs. I'm going to see today, while I'd work, if anyone actually notices these cuts. Because I had two people notice yesterday, and ask if it was cats. So, yeah, I'm doing a little test on human minds. This just in. I got the test results. Sorry, this video took a little while to get to. I was, was very busy today, and yesterday was a weird one. First of all, I quit my job. I hate working for Lowe's. Never working at retail again. I have to hold my tongue, doing things that make no sense. The world is madness. Oh, but the test results on these, the cuts, are that one in a hundred, at least depending where you live, like Texas, Rockwall, one in a hundred people will ask and about what's wrong or what happened. The other half, the other 99%, 99 people would just walk on by with their own business. It's ridiculous if you ask me. Excuse me. But that's the world we live in. Which means, think if you're in a bigger city, like Dallas, one in a thousand will stop and talk about problems and help. So, yeah. My definition, my ideas for humanity is lowered greatly. Because so far we're complaining about the things that shouldn't complain and we're fixing things that should stay demolished or whatever. I'm, I'm talking like the Notre Dame church. I don't mm, wasting so much money on repairing that when we could be solving world hunger, cancer, etc. Two billion or two million, something like that, to just put down and back together a church. Ugh. Religion is foolish. But yeah, see? Help a monument, not a person. Help your own self interest, not others' needs. We're all going to hell, at least the people that don't try. And this is my way of trying since I don't have a job right now, so I can't exactly <sighs> donate nothing because if I, because, well, I've, as I've said before, society, money, etc., it's all corrupt either way, but because of that, everyone needs money to survive in this world. Hopefully, when I'm dead, heaven or hell, there won't be no such thing as currency like there is today when when really we can live without currency. As I've said in a previous video, it's all about rewards and stuff. I think things that make, making working towards a goal. That's what normally motivates. So that's what motivates people to work and stuff. Money, the promise of something, etc. But yeah. But because of the situation of humanity, we're screwed. We're literally, utterly screwed because hardly any of humanity, which one in thousand, if you go from humanity's total, like billions of people on this earth, ten percent of the human race would help others. Ninety-nine percent wouldn't. Which proves how bad this world has gotten. Ten percent is a lot if you go from like towns and stuff, but from the whole human era, that's not a lot. That's not a lot. I challenge you, humans that watch this. Oh, try your luck. Help a friend out. Help a stranger. Might get lucky. Might get something out of it. Might just make you feel darn good. So yeah. Just wanted to tell you my test results. That humanity has failed my test. At least. And we'll see what happens when I try something else. Have a good one, ladies and gentlemen. Be sure to like and comment if there's anything you want to add about said theory or said test. Goodbye. Until the next video.